Hello everyone, welcome back to Steam Code and welcome to another episode of our Discord.js tutorial series and in this tutorial we're going to be creating a DM command and this will send a direct message to the specified user. So let's jump right into it. So the first thing we're going to do is copy what we have inside of our ping.js file because this will serve as the basis by which we'll create our DM command. So we can just copy and paste this and we can change the name to DM and the description can be whatever you'd like. I'd say, I'll say sends a direct message to the specified user. And the first thing we're going to do is say that the message has been sent. So interaction dot reply a direct message has been sent to you. Then let's get the me let's get the member that sent this message. So we can say interact so we can create a variable var member and set that equal to interaction dot member. So this is the member that sent the interaction or sent the message. And then we can say member dot send and then whatever we'd like to send. This is a direct message sent by Steam code. All right, so let's test how this works. So first we need to deploy our commands as usual. So node deploy commands. And as you remember, the deploy commands is a file that we created a few tutorials back. All it does is it updates our slash commands. So go back to that tutorial if you need to get a refresher. And then now it's actually boot up the bot because now it's offline. So we need to make it online. So node index dot js and let's test it so slash command dm and as you can see it replies to that dm slash command a direct message has been sent to you so now if we go to our direct messages we see we have a new one from steam code bot so hello steam code bot it's not configured to respond to any messages you send it that can be for a future tutorial but this is a simple overview of how you can start sending messages to your users with your bot. So it doesn't all have to be manual. All right. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section down below or throw them within our Discord server where I can respond to them. And I'll see you guys. I see you all next time.